Hi, my name is Ryan, and I'd like to tell you about machine learning on Google Cloud. In the next few minutes, we'll talk about several of the different machine learning options on Google Cloud, from pre-trained APIs to managed platforms. Ready? Let's get started. Google Cloud has many different machine learning products for developers to use. These span a wide spectrum depending on your experience level and project needs. On one side, we have machine learning APIs, which you can use even if you have little machine learning experience yourself. On the other side, we have Vertex AI and AI infrastructure products, which allow you to build and deploy your own custom machine learning models. Let's take a closer look. In the first episode of Google Cloud Essentials, we talked about how cloud computing is all about getting things done using someone else's computers. In the machine learning world, Google Cloud shares its machine learning capabilities with developers through the machine learning APIs. With these APIs, you can gain insights from data using Google Cloud's pre-trained machine learning models. And what's awesome about these APIs is that they require zero prior knowledge of machine learning. Basically, Google Cloud handles the training aspect of machine learning, gathering data and building a predictive model, allowing you to jump straight to the prediction aspect where you give the API data and get back information about that data. The Vision API lets you gain insights about your image using Google Cloud's pre-trained vision models. One feature is face detection. Detecting different faces in an image along with the likelihood that each face has emotions like joy, sorrow, and anger. Another feature is object detection. Detecting different objects in the image with a confidence score for each one. The Vision API also makes it easy to detect text, logos, and landmarks. Another machine learning API to check out is the Natural Language API, which helps you analyze text. You can detect entity keywords in the text, perform sentiment analysis, analyze syntax, and categorize the text based on its topic. There are also several other machine learning APIs, including the Video Intelligence API, Translation API, Speech-to-Text API, Text-to-Speech API, and the Cloud Inference API. As a developer, you can call all of these machine learning APIs from your code using client libraries and programming languages like Python, Node.js, Java, Go, c -sharp, PHP, and Ruby. The machine learning APIs are easy to use since Google handles data collection, model training, and maintenance. But what if you want to train a machine learning model using your own custom data set? This is where AutoML comes into play. With AutoML, you provide training data and Google Cloud builds a machine learning model for you that comes with a prediction endpoint. There are several different AutoML products, including AutoML Vision, AutoML Natural Language, AutoML Translation, AutoML Video Intelligence, and AutoML Tables. These are all accessible via the Vertex AI section of the Google Cloud console. Let's take a look at an example AutoML use case. Perhaps you're a meteorologist looking to use machine learning to identify different types of clouds, like Cirrus, Cumulonimbus, or Stratus. With the pre-trained Vision API, you might be able to identify that there are clouds in an image, but not what type of clouds they are. This more specific task requires a custom data set. With AutoML Vision, you can upload your own custom image data set of clouds, each one labeled as Cirrus, Cumulonimbus, or Stratus. Then, Google Cloud will use this custom training data set to train a machine learning model. Finally, you'll be provided with a prediction endpoint that you can use to classify new images of clouds. You'll also be able to see evaluation metrics for the model, like precision, recall, and the confusion matrix. The machine learning APIs in AutoML are great if you want to use or build upon a pre-trained model that Google has already created. But what if your needs are beyond that? This brings us to Vertex AI, a managed machine learning platform that lets you build, deploy, and scale ML models faster. In fact, it requires about 80% fewer lines of code to train a custom model on Vertex AI versus other platforms. Vertex AI integrates with widely used open source machine learning frameworks, such as TensorFlow, PyTorch, and Scikit-Learn, and can also support all ML frameworks via custom containers for training and prediction. Vertex AI is a single platform with all the tools you need to manage all the steps in a custom machine learning workflow. This includes, creating a data set and uploading data, training an ML model on your data, uploading and storing your model in Vertex AI, deploying your trained model to an endpoint for online predictions, 
running batch prediction jobs, and managing your models and endpoints. Vertex AI also features ML Ops tools to easily manage your data and models with confidence and repeat at scale. These tools include Vertex AI model monitoring for monitoring the quality of your deployed models, Vertex AI pipelines for orchestrating repeatable training and serving pipelines, and Vertex AI feature store for organizing, storing, and serving features. To interact with Vertex AI, you can use notebooks prepackaged with JupyterLab and deep learning packages, the Google Cloud Console to manage your ML resources and get access to monitoring and logging, and the Cloud Client Libraries and REST APIs to call Vertex AI from your code. While Vertex AI is a great managed solution for building and deploying machine learning models to the cloud, perhaps you want to handle even more of the process yourself. This brings us to AI infrastructure tools. These give you the raw machines and tools that you can use to build and host machine learning models. Deep Learning VM images are Google Compute Engine instances that come pre-installed with the latest versions of machine learning frameworks like TensorFlow, PyTorch, and Scikit-Learn. There are also cloud GPUs, which are great for speeding up compute jobs like machine learning, scientific computing, and 3D visualization. And finally, there are cloud TPUs, which help you train and run machine learning models faster than before. These topics can fill a whole video on their own, so we won't go into depth about them here. So there you have it, an overview of several different Google Cloud products you can use for machine learning, ranging from pre-trained APIs to a managed platform for developing and deploying your own machine learning models. Make sure to check out other episodes of Google Cloud Essentials, where we cover topics like storing data on Google Cloud, the Google Cloud Console, the Google Cloud SDK, key use cases, and more. I can't wait to see what you build with Google Cloud.